Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Over here, Iona. One of these ships can take us to Solstein. Looking to hire a boat? Captain Gallen does the business around here. Okay. Ships. Thank you. Are you the captain? Seeking passage to Solstein? Yes, we'd like to go to Solstein. My ship's ready to sail. If you've brought enough gold. Here you go, 250 gold. Get yourself settled then. What a beautiful view. Well, here we are. Welcome to Ravenrock. Just be careful here. Things aren't what they used to be. We left Windhelm to come here to Solstein. To help find a moon amulet for the Khajiit known as Karjo. Who the hell is this? I don't recognize you. So I'll assume this is your first visit to Ravenrock, Outlander. State your intentions. It's really none of your business. That's the kind of attitude that's going to land you in prison. I'll let it go for now. Just remember, Raven Rock is sovereign territory of House Redoran. This is Morrowind, not Skywind. While you're here, you will be expected to abide by our laws. Any questions? Why are you so suspicious of visitors? Second counselor, the security of Raven Rock was my primary concern. Has security been an issue? This isn't exactly the city of Blacklight. We're on the frontier out here. We've had more than a fair share of troubles. After all we've been through together, I refuse to let Counselor Morvain down. What do your titles mean? Counselor Morvain. House Redoran's representative on Solstein. As second counselor, it's my job to support him and make certain his rule is enforced. Hail, Jolland. I have no more questions. Before you even ask, yes. All right, Iona, come on. Digging our houses out from beneath the ash by now. Damn it, Jollens, you know we don't have that. Alright, let's keep moving. Alright, so anyhow, we left uh Windhelm to come here to Solstein to look for this amulet that was lost. And I'm also going to pay a visit to Delvin Mallory's brother member of the Thieves Guild. Delvin is, anyway. I don't know the status of his brother. So, I thought I would wear my Thieves Guild Master outfit. And also, because I'm standing out like a sore thumb in that red and black suit of the Assassin. You. You're Delvin's brother. You haven't seen Crescius Corellius, have you? That foolish old man's taking my pickaxe again. Hmm. Why all the fuss over a simple pickaxe? No, no, no. This isn't just your run-of-the-mill pickaxe. I'm talking about an ancient Nordic pickaxe. They don't exactly grow on trees, you know. Can't you just get the guard to find Crescius? Um, I prefer to handle these things on my own. 
Look, if you see Crescious, tell him to give me that pickaxe back, and I'll pay you for the trouble. I noticed the shadow mark by your door. Well, well. It's been a long time since someone from the guilds bothered to make their way out here. So tell me, how's my brother Delvin? Still spending his nights at the Ragged Flagon trying to win Vex's heart? You know that's right. Good to hear. Tam Layabout never even bothers to send his own flesh and blood a letter saying how he's doing. Can you imagine? Anyway, I suppose you're looking for work. Well, I got bad news. This place is drier than a damn bone. I'm not actually looking for work. I'm here on a mission. Eager to make some coin, eh? That's the spirit. <laughs> I'll tell you what. The guild's got a problem out here that I've been trying to deal with for years, but haven't been able to handle. The Thieves' Guild has a problem out here? In the middle of what looks like nowhere? Don't look at me like that. I'm all alone out here, with no one to watch my back. And besides, it's really my problem anyway. I caused it. That figures. What did you do? A fellow Breton who went by the name Esmond Tyne showed up at my doorstep about a fortnight ago. He noticed the shadow marks like you did, and I thought he was one of us. He stole something from you, right? That he did, right out from under my nose. Can you believe it? I'm starting to. It's my own formula for improved bone mold. Took me years to perfect. Where's Esmond Tyne now? Well, before he ran off, he was talking some nonsense about trying to fence goods to the Reeklings at Castle Karstag. I told him he was crazy to even think about talking to those vicious little buggers. But he wouldn't listen. I'd bet a fat purse of coin that he's either dead or hiding out up there. Alright, when I have the time, I'll get the formula back for you. You do that, and I'll make sure you're set up right. You won't be disappointed. How did you end up in Raven Rock anyway? A fine question, and the one that I hear most often from visitors to our town. I wish I had a more romantic tale to tell, but I was simply seeking my fortune and chose Raven Rock to ply my trade. Besides, knowing how to repair bone mold armor wasn't very useful in Riften. Who taught you that? I had a friend over there. A dark elf named Van Reif, a very talented armor smith. Spent a lot of time with the guy swapping smithing techniques. Learned a heck of a lot, including how to repair bone mold. After he moved on to greener pastures, I decided to pack up, move out here, and put those lessons to the test. Been here ever since. And what is an ancient Nordic pickaxe? It's the only tool tough enough to crack Stallrim, is what it is. Not many of those beauties left in the world. Forging them is a lost art. The one Crescious borrowed came from the Skull Village up north. I, uh, traded them some goods for it. I take it that Stallrim is some type of ore. Calling Stallrim an ore is like calling my forge a campfire. Some folks say it's enchanted ice, but I think there's more to it than that. I assume it's rare. I don't think I've come across more than a chunk or two in my lifetime, and smithing's my trade. If you're looking to learn more, you should head over to the Skull Village. Someone there's bound to know more about it than I do. Alright, well, you're always welcome back at the Thieves' Guild in Riften. I'm sure your brother would be happy to see you. Good day. You tell Crescious he better give that pickaxe back to me, or else. What the heck is this? Skate? Scath crawl? Hmm. This is like one of the ugliest plants I've ever seen. And it's everywhere. Alright, let's uh trauma root huh well hopefully this stuff is useful when I have the 
chance. I'll have to analyze this. All right, so let's check out this map and see how far. Oh, it's okay. It's not that far. Blood Skull Barrow. I guess we're going to have to uh, walk there on foot since our horses, we weren't allowed to bring them with us on the boat. What is this? Is this someone's home? Just curious. Let's go on in here. Who said that? What is it? I'm just curious. Is look look at the architecture of this home. We are certainly not in Skyrim anymore. I think it's this woman over here that said, "Can I help you?" My husband Bendel feared visitors would shun Raven Rock. I'm glad to see he was mistaken. Always nice to speak to someone from the mainland. Oh, uh, yes, it was nice to meet you. I'm sorry to barge in. I'm just, like, really curious about the homes here. Um, you know, I would walk downstairs, but I think that's kind of an intrusion. Let's go, uh, Iona. need to eat this so I uh, know what it's here what it does the scathe pro crowd crawl that they have forgotten you there do we toil? why are you talking like that some sort of a mind controlled Being, what the hell is this? By night we will play. You there, what's going on? By day was stolen ourselves. Hello, never near to us. Activate Earthstone. Hold on before I do this. Now through him do we Let me just take a little preparation here. Oh hell, what did I do? Now through them do I speak. What the hell just happened to me? And when the world shall see you. Blacked out for a minute. Here in it that they have forgotten. Iona, what just happened? I heard a voice that we might remember by night we reclaim. I hope this doesn't have any kind of a lasting effect on me. Iona, are you all right? Did you hear that voice too? Uh, we're doing the not talking to me again. Come on, let's go. Let's get over here to Blood Skull Barrow. I just hope I'm okay. Lost complete track of time back there. What? Oh, 
here she comes. Uh oh, something's up here. What is it? Blunderer Berserker. Let's get this dragon bone hatchet. This is different. You all right, Iona? Still got someone else up here. Oh, no. oh, here he comes. You were saying? What a mutant. Bandit spell marred mutant. All right. Bug was just tempting me to catch it. All right, I think we've got to go upstairs to get to the entrance. Looks like it's going to be that door there, but how do we get across? Ah, oh, here we go. Ah, chest. Looks like someone was in here cooking. Let me just check up here. I don't want anybody to come up behind us. A Dunmer outfit.
Another chest down here. Where is everybody? We killed them all? Seems like there should be someone lurking around here somewhere. Read scrawled note. Look, Merwin. I'm not arguing that these towers are falling to pieces, but I think you're exaggerating about the planks falling on... Uh-oh, what the hell? Alright, well, at least nothing fell on me. Alright, Iona. Let's get over here and see if we can't find this moon amulet. It's a Nordic rune, thousands of years old. Alright, let's go silent. I don't know what's in here, who's in here. Oh shit, look out, there's someone coming. Gold. What the hell? I'm sure it was him that murdered these people. And an Imperial. High Elf and an Imperial, that's interesting. Why? Alright. Iona, I want you to wait here. Yes, my Thane? As you wish, my Thane. Looked like someone was sitting there. There's a bunch of dead droggers by a fire. What? And the way that they're positioned, there's something very strange going on here. saw something moving as though they were invisible, but I guess not. Alright, I just want to make sure there's no surprises here. Said, come over here. I was sure I heard something. I'm sure what? you heard something no. too. No, this can't be happening. Ah! Ah! Okay, elf 
bow and arrows, plenty of gold. Oh, this Apothis armor is expensive. Mmm, even more gold. Rubies, silver. Here's this stall rim that uh, this Glover was talking about. That's much better. Alright, so these are just ordinary clothes. And here we should have the moon amulet. Excellent. Alright, we need to get this back to Carjo. And what's this here? Looks like I picked up another quest. Hmm, see, I would have missed this if I hadn't brought this torch out. Alright, let me go back and get Iona. I think there's a little bit more to this place we can uh, search here. You ready? Finally, you're back. Uh, what? Iona! Iona! Follow me. Go, my friend. I will protect you with my life. You really gotta check that attitude. Come on, let's go. door and there doesn't seem to be a lever. Huh? Yeah. You see anything to pull? Any chain? Huh. Can I help you? The holds of Skyrim. We're leaving. Careful around the burial stones. Uh, what's there to be careful of? All right, now I don't know if we can get back to. Skyrim, a weekend. Okay, and we are back at uh, Windhelm. Let's see, where is Carjo? All right, let's head to Dawnstar. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, he's right here. Anyhow, Carjo. Bring your coins. Why are you guys standing in line? What is this? This is kind of bizarre. The mountains of Skyrim rise. The road makes this is ready for any trouble. I have your amulet. There it is. Ah, home. If you ever need the skills of a Khajiit warrior by your side, I would be honored to travel with you. Until then, here. This is for you. In thanks. And thank you. The roads of Skyrim can be treacherous. If you must walk them, be wary. Yes, my thing? All right, well, that concludes our mission to Solstheim, going there for the first time. Can I help you? Back in Skyrim. Until next time. Yeah.